So now let's take a look at how we can use the transform tool to place our character in different ways. So once you select a layer right over here, you go to transform right over here on the right in the behavior section that is on the properties section right here. And then here you have options like opacity, which you can use to uh, change out the character right here. You can make the tra character transparent just like this, as you can see. You can also rotate the character out and you can see that it rotates. The character rotates out as you uh, like click and drag the rotation handle right here or click and drag it out. You can also type in values like 45 degrees and it gets rotated just like this. Let me just change it out into zero right here uh, so that it goes back to normal right over there. You can scale out your uh, layer as well as you can see right here. You can scale it out from the side, scale X and scale Y. So let me just go back to normal by pressing Ctrl Z. And if I were to go to scale, then it scales out from all of the sections right here. You can change the position right here. You can change the X position, the Y position over here as well. And then over here, now let us come to the anchor point. So if I were to go to rotation right here, it rotates from this side. So there is nothing to actually show you, but the anchor point is usually on the center. So if I were to change out the anchor point right here, imagine this. So imagine that there is a point right here and the point is not moving right there. So as it goes right here, the point still remains here. That is the anchor point still remains here. If I were to rotate this out, now it rotates out from that point, as you can see right over there. So I can go over here, change out the anchor point right here, change out the Y position as well. And if I were to rotate this out, you can see that it changes from that point now. So if I were to go for zero and zero, it stays right on the center of the character now. So if I were to rotate it, is on the center, but if I were to do Y axis right over here, the anchor point stays right over here. So as I rotate out, it rotates out from that point. So this is very, very um, clear in After Effects, but over here in Character Animator, you have to imagine the point right here when you choose around the anchor point right here. So just like that, you can control out uh, the character position and everything else with the transform tool. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.